This is the run to fem play. Uh, in this situation, Manitoba's lined up in a double tight end set. So they've put three receivers to the field and they've loaded the box to try and help them with their run by spacing us out. To counter that, what we have done is we've put five linemen up on the field by adding in with our linebackers on the line of scrimmage. And we've brought our defense a halfback inside the box area to help with defending the run. When we run this play, we want to make sure that we come off low and hard to the ball and get underneath the pads, making sure we have good gap responsibility. So our two t defensive ends here are taking care of the B gaps and our nose guard is trying to do a double A gap control. Our outside linebackers, what they want to do is hold the line and control the tight ends and not allow an easy release. If we are effective in doing this, we should be able to get our two linebackers that are sitting over the top free to run towards the ball. When we look at this from the tight line, you can see how our alignment is. So our two defensive ends have reduced and have lined on the outside edges of the guards, and our nose is lined up head up on the center. All right, two outside linebackers have lined up on the tight ends, and we have another linebacker, uh, two linebackers spaced over the top on the play side. Because there's no receiver out to the boundary, what we've done is we've brought the halfback inside the box to help run support, and we have a safety sitting over the top. When we come off the ball here, we want to make sure, again, that both of our, all of our linemen are low and they're attacking the gaps that they're responsible for. Our nose guard is going to have a two-way go trying to protect both of the A gaps, while our outside linebackers are sitting hard on the tight ends, not allowing any type of release, and the safety is spying into the backfield in this case. You can see that our defensive end here has used a swim move and made himself narrow to split the gap and is able to come through and make a, a great tackle on the play. We get a good squeeze from our linebackers and there's not a lot of running space in between the tight ends. So the only option he has is to try and bounce it wide, but there's no space through there either as our deep linebacker has done a good job of coming upfield to protect the gap.